<laughs> There's a Trinity room here. What? You need a chosen one Trinity room. Okay. Is it from here? So the King Riddles surprise box. A box gifted by the King of Riddles. Its contents are unknown. The King Riddles is generous even to those uh, who give wrong answers. There might be pain, but they won't leave empty-handed. Ah, <laughs> uh, decay. Such a prankster, man. By the way, we're, we had a conversation earlier from Venini. The King of Riddles has the same um, same name or same last name uh, as the, the murderer who killed his parents. Yeah. Oh, why am I using that? Oh my goodness. Discover all Trinity Sanctums. So he is the, the one calling us? Is that right? Heard something. Oh my, an actual factual guest. <laughs> I bid you welcome, Puppet of Geppetto. This is our first face to face meeting, isn't it? <laughs> Holy moly, he has a star stuck in his heart. To the rhyming. It gets to be a chore without the transmitter to help. Welcome to my Sanctum of Riddles. I admit I did not really expect you to make this journey in person. Oh, the havoc you must have wreaked along the way. Was there much blood other than what's all over you? Oil, oil, not blood. I know all about those alchemist cowards. Hiding away on their island, growing more monstrous by the day, refusing to acknowledge either fact that they are hiding or that they are monsters. And how about you? Is this the real you? Or are you still practicing the liar's art as only you can? <laughs> you must. Answer. <laughs> the question is simple, but I repeat. Oh, is this where we decide? Answer. And that answer will show what or who <laughs> you are. Who you have decided to be. Now listen closely and heed the king's speech, or the answer to this one will stay out of reach. Are you a puppet or a human being? Which one are you? Do I have to choose here? Are you a puppet or a human being? We go for human this time. Why did he go for Benini's parents though? The thing that truly drives me. <laughs> and it was so much fun. <laughs> even if you're lying right now, even if you don't believe your own answer, the truth is clear. 
proof is evident. Only humans practice deception so intensely for reasons that are so... unnecessary. Oh. Well, huh. these moments of clarity are enjoyable. <laughs> now the rhyming, it helps me maintain focus. At, at least it helps me hide. The urge to kill, they yeah. feel every waking moment. <laughs> but no play can go on forever. No. It was fun while it lasted, son of Geppetto. The king of riddles shall now retire. Alchemist Cape Quartz. We have four quartz now. We can upgrade the last one now. Someone stuck a weapon into his heart though. The play is over. You don't have to go home or straight to hell. Though that would be my choice. But you can't stay here. Not if you want to live. <laughs> Aren't you curious, huh? Don't you want to know? Oh, of course you do. Delicious. <laughs> time is all I have left. But your time is limited, Geppetto boy. I will gladly waste every moment you have if you like. It's your life. So, come on. Now or never. This tower is absorbing all the air-going crot. It was built in this precise location because it's the most efficient place in the world to study and use ergo wavelengths. But it's not even about me. Or you, either. This is about the goddess in the tower. Now she... That's Sophia, right? ...is worth saving. Her powers are impossible. Her knowledge is endless. She is more... Well... Awakened... Than any of us. And you see... She has so much power. It's not like she'll miss just a little. So, I have simply been sharing. Why bother? Well, <laughs> I was bored. <laughs> Is there any more human motivation in all the world? Huh? What if I made a puppet? Of a human. The way they made humans. Oh, puppets. What could possibly be more fun? More suitable? Creepy <laughs> man. Sophie is a good if you got us. Okay. You don't have to go home. Your eyes are sharper than your wit. You found the gift I left behind. <laughs> Wasn't it a sight to behold? Huh? I learned from uh, an alchemist when I served him. Thanks to him and his surprisingly low pain threshold, I learned the location of their secret island. <laughs> Humanity sullied its own sanctum long before I found it. Blasphemed against itself. Against us. By playing God. But I'm an artist. Murderer is a word the humans use to restrain us, to make us refuse our strength and power. <laughs> yeah, so he killed Vanini's parents. Fuck you. An artist of 
I would say, you know. I have to admit, selling that particular sanctum was well. This turns for blood. <laughs> Fun. Even now, the memory is enough to make me shudder with something approaching joy. If only I could relive that triumph. <laughs> yeah, seems like it. They were at the wrong place at the wrong time. The play is Who behind Benini's incident? Let's go. Benini? Oh, a beautiful fool, but a fool nonetheless. A mere slip of a boy when I met him. And did he ever thank me for making him an orphan with my bare hands? Like for giving him everything he has on a silver platter by removing the dead weight holding him back. Huh. Of course I'm not sorry. It was a delectable murder. Of the many, many I have committed since the Beninis, they have to be my Holy personal moly. favorites. They engineered the very first automated puppets. Enslaved no, they were not at the wrong place at the wrong time. He went for done. them. I didn't go there to take revenge for what his parents did. I mainly just wanted to slaughter them because they were so damned happy. Oh, what a great memory. Oh. In their last moments, they begged me not to kill their child. <laughs> So I didn't. I'm not a machine. I have free will. I made a choice in the heat of the moment. And it was a choice driven by that most human of emotions. Curiosity. If the child survived, would he be traumatized for life? Become a coward? A vengeful puppet hating bigot? A despairing wretch? Would he fling himself into the sea? Would he remember? The devil that orphaned him before his eyes was a puppet. He remembered, man. Would he remember? He remembered all the time. Arlequino. Not surprisingly, the alchemists and people of the workshop were as artless as I expected. Concealing the truth. <sighs> Thanks to them. I get to see Manini endure twice as much pain. <sighs> I cannot control myself. <laughs> oh, you're so satisfied. Manini is one of my greatest accomplishments. Perhaps even my masterpiece. <laughs> I suppose I can return this. I've held on to my little souvenir for quite some time. Tell him it's a little something to remember me by. Moon War Warrior toy. Toy. The play is open. Oh, I can attack him. So we can we can kill uh We can we can choose to kill these these NPCs, man. I don't know if I should though. I did not kill. Uh, who was it again? Uh, Alodini was it? I can't remember his name now. My my goldfish memory. Alidoro, yeah, my bad. Yeah, I mix up the name. Alidoro. I, I didn't kill Alidoro. And I don't know if I want to kill um, King of Riddles. A souvenir from the family murders obtained from the King of Riddles, Alec Kino. Is someone's handiwork left unfinished? The boy's thoughtful parents wanted to make a toy inspired by the warrior in the fantastic movie for their beloved son. 
However, the toy was never finished. I don't know if I should. The play is. We can always come back here though if you want to. They were killed because they were the first one who designed the puppets. Automated puppets. How do I reach the bottom part though? Here? Yep, here. Legion Caliber, very good. So there were two ways, right? We can call the leaf here, which I will. And there's another way here. It's also a lift though. What? This is going down though. This is the entrance, right? You're not hostile. I I'm not going back. I am sick of consuming ergo. It's cruel. There's real meals and real songs out there. I'm not just a memory reading tool. Has subject eight two six. What? You're not the inspector. But if you're from the outside. That means we can leave. Thanks. I know the way out, so don't No, worry no, no, me. you will die when you don't. Maybe oh you no, this outside. guy will die. Oh, happy. I can read memories of Ergo. That's what I was made for. Ergo is crystallized time and memory. But, God, I hate having to consume Ergo to read it. Why does it work like that? It's the worst. I can read memories, but I can't even dream of tastes, smells, or songs. I can't stand it anymore, so I'm escaping. When I get out, I'm going straight to Rosa Isabel Street. This guy will die there, man. I can read memories of Ergo. It's the one I can't st Oh, no. The moment I open this door, he's going there, right? We have to talk to Benini first before we decide if we want to kill uh, Alakino. Uh, Doctor Muscle Wizard, hello. What's up? Happy Thursday, man. We want to talk to this guy first with the happy emote.
and then we'll talk to Vanini, and then we'll decide if we want to kill Alakina. Hello, my lonely friend. What did you come to tell me? It feels good. Like being hugged by the sun. <laughs> It is a brilliant feeling, like the start of spring. Thanks. I that moon moonstone. I've learned something about humans. If I make human friends someday, I'll tell you. I wish you the best. You may not always be my only friend. Ah. Oh. You always be my first friend. Oh. A quartz. What? If I make human friends, you may not <laughs> Dude. Like, holy moly, man. This. We have to go to Rosa Isabel Street, who? To find a guy. Uh, from the island. Before we progress anything. We need to decide if we want to kill uh, uh, Alekino. As well. Uh huh. What should we go for? Vitality? Or Vigor? Having more stamina is good though. Uh, let's go fight it. Let's make it 20, 20, 20, 40. Yeah. You're here. Uh. I'm asking a question here if anyone knows the answer. So if I kill Alidoro, would I get more lore from Eugenie? Does anybody know? If I kill Alidoro, because if there's lore, right, I, I want to grab it on my first playthrough. Yeah? Okay. That means I have to kill Alidoro then. Because I want the, I want the lore on my first playthrough. Ah. Where is he again? Yeah, I want the lore, man. I need the lore. Also, we need to talk to Bernini. We might need to make a decision here to tell the truth of the lie there. The toy? But how... The toy my parents made me? You've met him. Arlecchino. We had just watched one of my favorite films, I remember. I begged them to make me the warrior from it. <sighs> if I had it, would my parents still be alive? Would we have been untouched by that murderous puppet? I've always blamed myself. <laughs> it's a hell of a burden for a child, that kind of guilt. So I hung on. I hung on to the Grand Covenant. I wanted to use it to keep people safe. You know, in many ways, I envy you. Your strength. Thank you for this. Talk about closure. Why not about the, about the last story of Adini? You are here. That's a relief. So you don't have to kill Alekino then. I have to talk to uh Might I have a moment, puppet of Geppetto? 
Pochinella? Yeah, Pochinella. I was a bit concerned my voice wouldn't even reach you. It has been so very long since I spoke out of turn. You see, I too have been awakened. I have an ego, as Master Vanini would say. And I have been this way for some time. Wow, that's long. At least since Master Lorenzini was a child. Master Lorenzini? He had no one else, you see. His parents. I'm sure you've heard of their Wow, well, it's. Fate. Yeah, Vanini, sorry. And he had to see it all. But Master Lorenzini is stronger than most people suspect. A puppet was the killer. We both knew it. But if we had told the authorities, they might have removed me from the household as well. The young master would have been yeah, alone he held it if I had been well. taken away. If only I could have saved them. Now I atone for that failure by thinking only of Master Vanini's prosperity and happiness. But even I did not realize how deeply he still held that trauma. How badly that murderous puppet had scarred his soul. You have set him free. I cannot thank you enough. I am not accustomed to sharing such thoughts or feelings. But when it involves Look away. Master Vanini, please accept this gift as it truly comes from the heart. My own. We will always roll out the red carpet for you at the house of Vanini. Oh, wow. That's cool. At the house of Vanini.